What if I told you I couldn't stay Take me or leave me You can still walk away Guys, Jin here and welcome back to Blindly Honestly and if you are new I really hope you enjoyed today's video as well. So today I am going to be trying out and reviewing an indie brand. So this brand is called Misfit Beauty Company. They are an online based company and they also um, advertise the majority of their products on Instagram. That is personally where I found out about them. I've been following them on Instagram for about a year now and I just finally went around or got around to actually purchasing from them. I actually bought four different lip toppers. These are $3 each and they are just these small little containers. So I have Nessie, which is this really pretty aquamarine teal color. Then we have Honey Me Up, which is a very pretty gold, followed by Ember, which is this gorgeous shimmery red. Then we have Nightmare on Elm, which is pitch, pitch black. I'm kind of terrified of this shade, but we're going to see how it works. So because these are lip toppers and not lipsticks, I am going to apply a um, lip liner to my lip. This is Contempo from ColourPop. Very pretty, neutral pink nude. All right, so I'm going to start by applying the lip liner, and this is just Contempo. And this is just going to help the color pay off a little bit. So I'm going to start with Nessie, which is that really pretty teal aquamarine shade. And I want you guys to see, these are very, very thick and creamy. So I'm going to use a lipstick brush for this. This is from Sephora. And we're going to apply Nessie. I wish I had this when I did my mermaid tutorial the other day. Okay, so these are not very pigmented. I'm gonna see if I can build up the pigmentation because right now I'm kinda disappointed. I don't like how goopy it is and like, oh, when I open my mouth, I have strings. Okay, so you can build it up. I don't know if it's gonna dry down or not. And that's got me worried so it's not bad it's a very very pretty shade but like I said when I open my mouth you can see the ring on my lips let me grab some tissue and see if I can blot this down cuz I'm I don't like how it looks be right back okay so I apply a little bit more and I'm still getting like the nasty stringiness that's why I'm trying not to show my mouth so I'm going to blot this tissue and see if it helps. And it just wipes it all off. Well, that sucks. So I'm assuming this is just a glosser, not actual lipstick. And it can't be made to be lipstick, unfortunately. That's very disappointing because the color in the pan really really gives me hope for what could be as a lipstick because look at that that's gorgeous and it just doesn't quite pay off enough for me but we're gonna switch to a different shade and see if it's the same results next I'm going to try honey me up which is this really pretty gold and I'm kind of hoping it doesn't do the same thing, but so this is the shade and it's very pretty, just like melted gold. So again, with this one, any attempt to build it up just results in having like that stickiness ring around the inside of your lip, which I'm not feeling. But with this over the Contempo lip liner, it is very pretty. I'm hoping you guys can see this. I like it. I can't see it lasting all day. I mean, it would be good for a photo shoot, but I don't think it's gonna be good for an all day wear. So next we are going to jump into Ember, which Ember is like molten lava. It's really pretty. This is Ember. So yeah, these lip toppers are just that. They're just lip toppers. Um, 
And I'm maybe Nightmare on Elm will be a little bit different, but from what I'm seeing, they're just lip toppers. I wish this was just a lipstick. It's like a metallic red, very, very pretty. So on the website, it does actually say that you can use as a lip topper or as a lipstick slash gloss. So I did not apply Contempo on underneath this time. This is just um, Ember by itself. It's really pretty. It has like that really pretty gloss. So if you don't put a bunch, it doesn't do that sticky ring thing. So last but not least, we have Nightmare on Elm. This one literally looks like a jar full of ink. We're going to apply this and see how it looks. See, I really wish that I could build this up without it ending up nasty because by itself, it's not very pretty. Out of all of these, I feel like Nessie was my favorite. It is the prettiest shade out of all of them. I feel like it was the best topper. Um, Ember is really pretty. I would like to have it as a um, regular lipstick. Honey Me Up was okay. It didn't do much but add a gloss to your lips. And Nightmare on Elm just didn't do anything. <laughs> So I will leave a link to the Misfit Beauty Company down below if you're interested. And if you like this video, please hit that like button. Subscribe if you haven't already. And if you want to join my hashtag Butterfly Squad, make sure you ring my bell because then that way you'll be notified every time I upload new videos. I upload every Monday, Wednesday, and Friday at 9 a.m. Pacific. Next week, I will be uploading a video on Thursday for you guys. It's a surprise collab, so look out for that. And on Mondays around 2, 2.30 in the afternoon, I go live with Let's Play Mondays, where I play a video game, and lately I've been playing Doom. And Friday nights around 7.30, 8 o'clock, I go live with Beauty Chats with Jen, where I chat about all things beauty-related in the community and releases, whatever comes to mind. So if you ever want to chat and hang out, catch me on a live stream. And with that, I'm going to get going. As always, I wish you guys lots of love and whiskers, and I will catch you the next one. Love you. Bye. What if I told you I couldn't stay? Take me or leave me. You can still walk away.